what I propose to do is two things. First of all is to, is to move to a more rational cost sharing system for Medicare. This would have three features. First, it would have a small deductible at $500. Then it would have, well, first it would integrate parts A and B into one system. You'd then have a small deductible at $500. You'd then have a 20% coinsurance, but you'd have an out-of-pocket limit. Okay, this idea dates back to 1988 with the catastrophic reforms that failed the Medicare, have an out-of-pocket limit. But what's different about my projection is when people have talked about out-of-pocket limits, they've talked about numbers like a $5,000 out-of-pocket limit. We have to appreciate half of seniors live below two times the poverty line. Okay, a $5,000 out-of-pocket limit at two times the poverty line is 25% of income. Okay, that's not feasible to ask seniors who are high spending to year after year spend 25% of their income on medical care. So what I'd propose is actually an income-related out-of-pocket limit, where seniors as a function of their income would pay lower limits and it go up as their incomes go up. It would parallel actually we've just done the Affordable Care Act. So an income-related out-of-pocket limit. My other proposal is to, and that proposal actually, by the way, doesn't save money, it actually probably costs money. If we take Medicare and put in the system I described plus an income related out of pocket uh, max, that probably costs money. That's why I'd pair it with a tax on Medigap plans as well as employer insurance that compensates Medicare for the externality those plans exert on the Medicare program. Now, I don't propose a rate of the tax. Um, the score up there, the score 125 billion is based on an estimate from, um, from the Office of the Actuary, from MedPAC, which uses a 20% tax. We can vary that rate. But the idea is essentially rationalize the cost sharing under Medicare so you no longer really need this supplemental insurance. And then if you still want it, that's fine, but you should bear the cost it imposed on the Medicare program. 